just about to get underway and towing the slab, Domingo Robles. What do we have on him? Well, I'm interested to see how he deals with right-handed hitters in this one. Righties are batting over 300 against him, so they're not being fooled by really anything. He's going to have to find it. Lofton puts it away, and there's two away. And now the center fielder, Alan Santos. Now batting center fielder, Alan Santos. First pitch, and he just misses. Come on now. One time, right here. And the 1 0. Center field, Jones sizes this one up, brings it in. That is the inning. Three innings. Now the batter now, Brewer Hicklin. Now batting, left field. The pitch. Hicklin. Hit pretty well in the air out to center. Santos makes the catch, and that'll do it. Hey, get a good one. Get Welcome good back, bottom of the six, and here is Alan Santos. Leading off, and first field. offering is fouled off. Alan. So Alan. important for him to control the heart rate right now. He's got to go through the heart of this lineup. Get your pitch up there. Righty delivers, and a foul ball. And the righty deals. And a swing and a miss. And one away. Well, one of the things that... One gone runner at first. Alan now Santos getting field. ready to hit. Alan Santos. First oh, pitch doesn't the find the right zone. Keep driving. Let's go, kid. And a foul ball, third base side. Here's a 1-1. Swing and a miss, and it's 1-2. and two. Romeri, the runner at first, with one gone to the inning. And down on strikes. That's out number two. Two-nothing, your final here in this one. For Chris Singleton and our entire crew, I'm John. Joe, during a season, you're going to see your fair share of struggles at the plate at some point or another. How do you work yourself out of it? How do you use the count to set yourself up in a favorable situation? Well, it, it's tough times when it goes like this, but uh, it happens, and um, it happens to the best of us. But uh, it's one is staying positive and um, trying to work back into hitters counts. You know, trying to get to two and zero, oh, uh, three and one, or three and zero, oh, and um, hopefully then you know the pitchers don't want to fall behind in the count, so they're going to come with right. probably the pitch with their best command, uh, which is usually a fastball. So hopefully you can get a fastball there and and don't miss it. Just about set to go now. On the hill and coming off a great start, Tommy Parsons. And singing a special day for him. He's making his major league debut here. And I'm sure he's got some nerves. He'll be excited for that first pitch to be in and over with so that he can settle in to pitching just like he did in the minor leagues. Exciting moment. He's got his family in town. I think this moment's going to be a huge tone setter for his career. Next offering is fouled back. Hey, one time, right now. Righty to the plate. The punch out there. Two gone now. Bell Boog, it becomes pretty difficult. And now the center fielder, Alan hey, Santos. Center fielder, Alan Santos. That one fouled off. One down, base is empty. Foul ball. Swing and a miss. Struck him out. And he's down on strikes. Number 35 will hit next. The batter. Number 35. Now fly ball to right center. 
Santos glides to his left and it gets by him. Wasting no time. He's two. And welcome back. And stepping in is the speedy number eight. The left field. Number eight. In the air, center field. Santos under it. Puts it away for the out. Here's the center fielder, Alan Santos. Now batting, center fielder, Alan Santos. In there for strike one. Well, he's so good about trying to drive the ball to the opposite field gap in these situations. If he takes that approach, he could bust this game wide open. The next offering misses, and that is ball one. Swing and a miss. And the count, one and two. Hitter's got some good opposite field power. What I like about something being hit to the right side into the outfield is that the base runner at second has a very good read. Back here at the ballpark, new inning getting started. Leading, Leading off, off C.J. Chatham. C.J. And he swings and lifts one to deep center field. Way back there. Pulls it in on the warning track. To the batter now, Alan Santos for the fourth time tonight. The center fielder, Alan. And a foul ball. Center. You'll one. That's a bullet, but it goes foul. Hey, see it. Drive it. Let's go, big dog. Lifted in the air, right center field. Makes the grab on the run. And that ends the end. So now it's the four-hole hitter, C.J. Chatham. Now batting. The shortstop. 0-2 oh, now. Chatham. In the air, out towards right center. Santos glides to his left. He's got it. And there's two away. Here's the shortstop at the plate. C.J. Chatham. Now batting. Shortstop. C.J. Chatham. That's towards center. Santos moving under this one. Puts the squeeze on that one. And that is. Welcome back. Bottom of the inning. And now the center fielder, Alan Santos. The center fielder, Alan Santos. And that's in there for strike one. Ripped, base hit. Romero rounds third, headed for the plate. He will score, and now they trail by one. Just a huge at bat right there. Everything was on time and fluid in that swing. Got a pitch you could get the barrel on and lined it in the center for the knock. Those always feel good. Now a huge runner on the goal. Cut on and miss. Applies the tag, and they get two. Double play. Well, I really didn't expect him to try to steal second base because he had a very standard lead at best. Vanguard, if you're going to try to get there field. safely, First, you've got to get more on that lead. So we're coming to the end of my YouTube video right now. So give a thumbs up button if you like the video so much. Click on that bell button to subscribe for more content. And if you saw the recent video interesting, share the comment right below the description. So you can share some thoughts and feelings with everybody in the community and make them feel welcome. So I make a happy Corona 95. You all have a great day and peace out.